Um, today I have, voila, an unboxing, which I'm sure you know by now what this box is. Now, the old boxes, like on the outside, it was pretty clearly like their, it was Diamond Art Club's box, but now they don't, they use different boxes than they used to, and I have it flipped over, that way you can't see my address, because not all you need to know where I live, so, um... I have one to show you today and typically you guys if you have been following me for a while then you're pretty good at guessing like which one I'm going to show you but this week there was no um, Hannah Lynn's or anything that's like my style I guess you could say. Um, tip like ones I've been getting typically so you probably cannot guess this time so I'm really excited um, I already have this card but um, yeah I got it for free so I thought I might as well add it in there um, to the $50 credit that way otherwise it would be like kind of a waste of that $50 credit. So I added that card in there because even though I had that particular card, this way I have one more and I can um, give it to somebody else because they're so cute and I was going to have a really hard time deciding like who was going to get the cards. So now I won't have that hard of, um, of a decision. So funny that I just now realized this because these packing slips I don't really like look at really I mean I don't think I've really paid that much attention to them but I just noticed that on the bottom of it is a code for 15% off um, so don't forget in case you've never noticed that before if you do order something from Diamond Art Club you will get a packing slip in the mail and on the bottom there is a coupon code um, for you to use. So, um, yeah, but I think that's it on this one. Um, just that, the card, and then this one. So let's get right into it. I honestly don't even remember if this one is, I'll flip it over and look in just a second, if it's a round, square, whatever, and the size, but this, I'm so excited. Um, if you guys get their emails, coming um when they like have new releases which they've pretty much been having new releases every single saturday for diamond and ruby members and monday for um the general public anyways this time it was like a bunch of christmas um once so the one i chose is a 51 by 71 and it is round with a b's so it's 20 by 28 inch. That would be your frame size. Um, like I said, it is a round. So let me move my camera over just a little bit because that way I have a little bit more of my desk showing. Okay, sorry. So in the round kit, in case you are not familiar with Diamond Art Club's um, product or if you've never seen an unboxing before, which would be really, um, where would you have had to be? But I don't know. Anyways, maybe not. They come with a typical drill pen, which, um, you know, just a basic drill pen, a squishy so that it's a little more comfortable, a clear boat tray with a funnel on the end of it, two heart waxes, and some baggies. And every so often they come with like a multi-placer. This one does not look like it has a multi-placer in it, but that's okay because I don't use those multi-placers anyways. I use the ones I have that are the um, the thin ones like this. If you're looking for them, don't forget to hit me up. Shine Shop Designs on Etsy. Uh, the link will be in the description below. Also on Shine Shop Etsy, you can on my Shine, on my Etsy account. Oh my word. The words sometimes just don't, don't like form correctly and then come out of my mouth the right way. Anyways, as I was trying to say, if you do go on to 
um, my Etsy store, which is Shine Shop Designs, as I've been trying to say here now. You can also find these awesome Diamond Art Club inhalers for when you open your own Diamond Art Club unboxings and you need a Diamond Art Hub Club inhaler because they take your breath away. Um, yeah, and there is pretty much almost any color under the sun that you could want. But back to this. I'm not going to show you the pack or the the slip yet, the sticker, because I don't want you to know what it is. Because I am just, you know, I don't know. I'm just like that. I want it to be a surprise because it's more fun that way. In here, you're going to get your instructions. There are the new instructions. It's like a little pamphlet thing. It tells you how to diamond paint and all that kind of stuff. And you get a little coupon code and, and all. Anyways. But if you're interested in that, go ahead and, I don't know, look at one of my old unboxings. Because I don't go through those every time because they're kind of boring. I do love, however, though. The Diamond Art Club is now um, packing things differently. So they used to put the inventory sticker inside of the canvas as well as your um, instructional flyer from them. And when you would unroll it, it would fly out. But now they are doing it differently. And I have to say, I am absolutely loving that they are doing it the way they're doing it because it makes it that much easier when you are using the sticker because it is not so tightly rolled up that you're trying to like flatten it and make your stickers not roll and all that stuff. So it's really nice the way they are packing them now. Um, so I hope they continue to do that. Now, of course, if you buy an old one or like a clearance one, chances are it's gonna be packed the old way. But if you get a newer one, then you'll get it the newer way. So, are y'all ready for this? I am so excited. I don't know how much confetti this one's gonna have. Um, this is a different artist. I'm going to lay it sideways so that you can see it, like most of it at one time. So one, two, three, ready, and ba-bam. Is that not, oh, it's so cute. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Okay, as you know, uh, if you've followed me much, I am like a huge, 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 huge animal lover. Um, mainly cats and dogs, but I love them all. I'm going to fold this down a little bit so that we can see like the main cuteness. Seriously, come on. Could they get any cuter? Like, seriously. I didn't expect that they were going to come out with another Christmas one that I would want bad enough to do because I already have um three and this is four which i won't have time for them all so um you guys can thank diamond art club for coming out with so many new cute ones that i am going to be giving away my santa and the reindeer one where it's like the black background is like the white trees and it's blue and it's really really gorgeous it's actually sold out uh last time i looked i will be giving that one away for christmas this year because I want to do this one because this one has a kitty and uh, this kitty reminds me of my kitten well my cat that we had to put down two years ago um and it was actually maybe it was only one year ago now that I think about it but anyways it, it looks like her when she was a kitten and that's what I thought of when I first saw it and so I just had to have this one so um, look at this. Okay, we're gonna look at the bottom, which I know isn't near as cute as the top because it has a kitty in it. So if you can see, it's like, it's a window. I'm gonna show you the sticker. I'll show you the sticker. So the kitty's looking out of a window. So there's like the window seal with some snow on it and a little bird um, and some trees. And then you've got your, your kitty sitting there um, with a tree or a wreath. I can't really tell, let's see. Yeah, I think it's a tree. A tree right here in the background. Um, kitty in the windowsill. And then a burning fireplace. How cute is that cat, you guys? Oh, my gosh. Ah, oh, so cute. 
so 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 cute and then the bush right here is holly it's a holly bush with some holly berries um i know my camera doesn't like to focus when i get things like really up close like this but um you should be able to see that like that how adorable is that so there's 43 colors in this one you guys um yeah so this one is definitely going to take a little longer than the christmas tree i'm working on right now there's so much color block even the one i'm working on now but this one um let's turn it to the side here for just a second um and this one has um a lot of color blocking in it there is like some respectable as miss coffee would say um confetti but it's not horrible at all like it's it's not bad it really isn't bad at all so um it should work out pretty nicely i think and it should turn out stinking adorable one thing i like that diamond art club is doing on their site like if you go and let's say you find this one and you really like it and you want to see okay this is what the picture is going to look like but what's it going to look like as a diamond painting they actually now show a picture of it as a diamond painting completed so you know what it's actually going to look like uh, as a completed diamond painting and that is awesome because some pictures that you find that you really like aren't going to look that um, great as a diamond painting. It's just the way it is. So I um, highly su suggest when you are looking at Diamond Art Club's page that you click on that link that shows you what it looks like as a diamond painting. I'm going to try to find that picture and post it right here. If I can't, then you're just seeing my fingers right here, but you know, what it, whatever. Anyways, let's see how many ABs are in this one. There are two ABs and it's looks like it's going to be the yellow and the white and the white, um, well, let's see. Let's just take a look. See, yeah. I'm we'll bringing it down a little closer. So that way you can see this adorable kitty cat a little bit closer. So stinking cute. Um, I'm trying to see like the main parts where the ABs are going to be. And the kitty cat has the, like all the white that you see in the kitty cat through here. Um, and like on her nose and like under here and everything. That's all ABs. Um, any of the, uh, fire, the fire over here, like over here. And then the white in that, those are all going to be ABs. Um, pretty much anywhere that there's yellow there, it's an AB. That's what it looks like to me. And not all of the white though here, like the snow, that's not all ABs. That's just white which I think is good because I think sometimes if you have too much AB, it's just too much. And so I like that they don't go completely like insanely overboard with the AB diamonds. Um, they just add enough to accent it to like just give it that sparkle, which there are accented um, ABs throughout the white part. So that's awesome. Um, and there's some ABs over here in the ornaments that are hanging on the tree. So that's going to make them just kind of stand out that much more. And then up on the top here, this is a candle. And so that is a bunch of ABs and this is ABs, which is another little candle. So yeah, this one's going to be awesome. And then there's ornaments hanging down right here. Like it's, it looks like it's a wreath actually. Yeah, it's a wreath right here off the la the mantle, um, right there. So if you can see this, that is a, um, a wreath. Let's see if I can show you. There we go, right here. So in this is um, like some hanging ornaments and those have ABs accented as well. So this one is going to be amazing and it's a good size. It's a 51 by 71, so it's not like huge but it's not small at the same sense so I like that it's I like the size I think it's going to be kind of like that perfect the happy medium size where it's not going to take 
you know, months and months to complete. And because there is a lot of color blocking, like these big chunks, that'll help uh, make it work up that much faster. So, okay, let's go ahead though. I'm gonna flip this over and we're gonna take a look at the drills. All right. So I'm gonna bring you down a little bit closer. Sorry about the shadows today, you guys. It is um, the middle of the day, but it's like kind of cloudy-ish. It was like so sunny this morning, um, which was awesome. But then now it, the sun has kind of went away and yeah. Okay, so we've got one that is not attached to the train and this is, um, by the way, I might have totally messed this up. I'm hoping I didn't. If I did, I'm going to fix y'all right now. No, I didn't. Okay, I didn't. I was making sure because I have my camera back to the way I used to do it. So I wanted to make sure I didn't have it upside down the entire time. I didn't. I'm pretty sure that I had it the right way for you guys to look at it. Um, and if I didn't, I'll have to try to fix that in editing. But... So here is your first color. It is 890 and it is a green, which that is why there's a lot of it because, well, there's a big old tree in there and that wreath and everything is gonna take a lot of green. Um, this one doesn't have as many 310s as like a lot of the ones I've been doing lately. So that will be, that'll be kind of nice. All right, so we've got 3371, which is like dark chocolate. Um, then we have 762, 498, very pretty Christmas red, 415, there's our whites that we've got going on right there, 3865, so there's two whites, um, and then there's only two little bags of 310s, so that is like nothing compared to what I've been doing lately. Then we've got 321, which is like a red, almost, almost like a really dark red fuchsia kind of color, 3024, um, 3861, 318, 666, which is that really bright, cheery red, uh, 3799, 775, I really like this color. Um, 141, which, as you know by now, if I shake it, shake a, shake a, shake a, it's an AB. And I love the white ABs. I think they're so pretty. Uh, 700. I like that green. Look at that. Now, you put that one and that Christmas, the 666 together, and there you go. Christmas colors. Um, 779, which is a, um... It's a brown, but like almost like a mauve brown. 720 orange, and then 754 peach. Put those to the side. We've got 814, which is a burgundy red. Um, 699, which is a green. 3860, which is a mauve. Um, 3864. Then, 938, which that is not a color I'm used to seeing, really. I don't remember that number. At 939, I, I see that all the time. This is like a dark brown, though. Um, it's like a really, really dark brown, like a um, chocolate brown. Uh, 3841, which is that pale blue. 891, which is that gorgeous fuchsia. Uh, 3770, 414, 317, 138, which is that AB, orange AB. I really like the orange ABs, and then when it, you know, that AB accent almost makes it like a pink orange looking. It's really cool looking though. I love it. 413, 3787. 844, 640, 701, beautiful green, love it, 893, that 8 is really, really bizarre looking, um, 838, 977, 645, 
743, 742, 906, and 976. So those are your girls. Um, again, if you can't tell, they're round. So the round one, as I've said like a bazillion times. And um, two ABs, 40, was it 43 I said? 49. 43 different colors, 51 by 71 centimeters, 20 by 28 inches. And the title of this one is Tabby Cat. As you can tell, because there's a tabby cat. I love tabby cats. They're so sweet. So sweet. Okay, guys. Um, I am super thrilled to do this. I'm, I'm like, I, I, yeah, I cannot wait. Um, I am doing the Christmas tree right now. I was talking about maybe doing Ice Princess for my Mary Calabamus that I am doing. But I'm not sure because we were talking about doing like the same ones. But we might... I might have to decide to do, we're both working on the tree right now, but I might have her do the Ice Princess and me do this one because I really, really want to do this one. Plus, I want to work at this one. I want to get this one done for Christmas time um, because this is another one I would love to have in my house during the Christmas season. Me, my husband, and my kids are all big animal lovers. My husband and son are like huge, huge cat people. So uh, this one is awesome. And I'm super excited to not only work on it, but get it done and up on my wall. So with that, um, I'm not going to show you the card. If you want to see that card, go back. I will try to remember to put that video in the description below. Um, I believe it was last week's that I did, part two. Um, was showing you all of the Diamond Art Club cards that they have available right now. And the one I chose to get again was the dog, of course, because he's so stinking cute. Um, so, as always, though, don't forget you are braver than you believe, stronger than you seem, smarter than you think. So with that, keep on shining, and I will see you guys next time. Bye! Thank you for watching, and if you haven't already and would like to subscribe, don't forget to hit that subscribe button below and the bell icon to be notified when I put up a new video.